The building blocks for Apple's rumored M3 chip are reportedly underway. Apple's Taiwan-based chip maker TSMC has reportedly begun pilot production on its 3 nanometer process, known as the N3 line. The plan hopes to move to full production by the end of 2022 and start shipments to Apple and Intel by early 2023, according to DG Times, citing unnamed sources. Apple's M1 and M1 Pro slash Max chips in the MacBook Air and MacBook Pro are based on a 5 nanometers process. Dropping down to 3 nanometers, a more advanced technology, should result in faster performance and improved efficiency. But first, Apple is expected to debut a 4 nanometers N4, M2 chip sometime next year with the launch of the MacBook Air. Apple rarely sheds light on upcoming projects, and it hasn't said anything about its plans for future silicon. However, a recent report by the information alleged Apple will use an advanced version of the 5 nanometers node for its second gen chips with two dies rather than just the one found in the M1, M1 Pro, and M1 Max. But the 3 nanometers third gen chips are what grabbed all the headlines. These will apparently represent a much bigger leap by using four dies and containing up to 40 CPU cores. To put that into perspective, the M1 Pro and M1 Max have only 10 CPU cores in an 8 performance, 2 efficiency configuration. Not only will the 3 nanometers node act as the blueprint for the engine powering upcoming MacBook and iPad models, but it could also guide the A17 and the iPhone 15. We're looking far into the future here, and any of these details are subject to change. But if Apple can continue advancing what are already among the fastest and most power-efficient chips found in consumer gadgets, then its rivals, particularly Intel, are going to have a tough time keeping pace.